Hello there. How are we? Merry Christmas, everyone. Um, aye, Christmas Day here in New Zealand. Santa's been. Rudolph's had a bit of carrot. Yeah, uh, Santa's drunk his beer and he's left it empty. The cheeky bastard. So I'm going to uh, head down to the south coast today and grab some green lip mussels for my for my starter for Christmas dinner, because that's one of my favourites. Um, aye, so get geared up. Head down to the, the south coast and hopefully I can grab some, some green lip mussels for a wee, wee start of the day. Looks like we're getting a bit of rain. So much for the um, roasted hot summer we were going to get this year, seemingly. So I'm just taking you through the centre of the, uh, the Wellington CBD. City along the Oriental Parade and then over to uh, just just near Scorchin Bay. And I've gathered some mussels here before, not for a wee while, mind you. Uh, but we'll head in there and grab a few for Christmas starter. Check these trees out, Perhutikawa trees. The Christmas tree over here they call them. So they they're green during the winter time and then they bloom with these beautiful red flowers in summer. Cool ass. So we arrived at the, the wee spot. The weather's turned to absolute shit. I had to single it earlier on now, put a jumper on. I'm actually surprised with the amount of people out fishing on Christmas Day. A lot of folk off the rocks as well over there. So you can see even from here, over on the rocks there, we've got mussels growing at the top. Now I'm going to dive under and grab the, the nice juicy green lip mussels. Yeah, we don't want the, the black ones. We want the nice green ones. Alright, I'm gonna get my stuff on and jump in. Put the mussels into the chilli bin, the ice packs, keep them nice and fresh with salt water. See they're still opened up. So I'll 
the clothes back up again. So close it back up. Yeah. So take them home and cook them up. Okay, so we've no long got back uh, for collecting the mussels. And I'll just go through the ingredients that we're going to use. Uh, we've got one small red onion, some three bird's eye Thai chilies. Uh, they're really good for flavour and very hot. Four cloves of garlic, fresh basil, some dill, chilli again, uh, paprika, tin of tomatoes, fish sauce and uh, some of the sea water that I collected earlier and a wee, a wee bit brown sugar. Okay, big lump of butter in, just let that melt. Then you want to be chucking the, the onion in. Sweat the onion off a bit, turn that up a wee bit. That's what it was the last time. Chilli and garlic in. You drop it out the sea water in. Tomatoes in, bush, some paprika, Let's fire it in there. Good for the flavour of the paprika. Woo! Turn the heat a bit back up. So all I'm going to do is just get, the, get a nice base sauce on the go, get all the ingredients in and then right at the end I'll get the heat up quite hot, I'll put some more of the, the sea water in and then I'll steam it or chuck the mussels in and just leave it for like 5 minutes or so, just until they open up and then they're ready. I'll fire the sugar in there. Brown sugar. A bit more chilli because I love chilli. I love chilli. Bit a messy cook to be honest. Just chuck things in. Right, what we're we going for next? A wee bit dull in it at the end and the basil at the end. Fish sauce. I like fish sauce. Very strong flavour but I love it. Love the fish sauce, goes well with the mussels as it's all from the sea. Mm. Smell that, it smells lovely. Chuck a wee bit basil in. 
wee bit down. Just rip it up, just tear it up, chuck it in. It smells beautiful. A wee bit of dill. Dill. Some of the dill in there. I don't, I don't do measurements, I just chuck stuff in. So we've got the dill, we've got the basil. Mmm, smells beautiful. Right, is that it? Is that all the ingredients? Right, we've got to ramp up the heat a bit. Put the mussels here ready to go. Put a bit more of that seawater in. Ramp up the heat even more. Right. Stuff through. I forgot the main ingredients actually. Never do anything with a bit of salt without a bit of salt and pepper, eh? Salt and pepper? Can't even, can't even forget the salt and pepper. Huh? Salt. Oh, that's close. Didn't want that. Where's the pepper? Pepper's there. The pepper. Right, time for the mussels. Push in there. Give them a wee juggle about. Get all the mixture in that. Get it all covered and coated. And then I'll fire this one. Get a wee shake about. Fire it up. And then when they open up, that's basically it ready. So there we go. Green lip mussels, picked only a couple of hours ago. Uh, fresh as. So I'm gonna do the taste test. <coughs> Quite spicy, like. What I do is I just grab the side of it and then just rip it open like that. Get some more of the juice. Mm. Absolutely beautiful, honestly. And the best thing about it, I get to eat all of that because nobody else in the house eats muscle. Mm. <whistles> Roasting, though. Absolutely fantastic. Tasty as. Mm. Oh, yeah. Can't get any fresher than that. So anyway, if you enjoyed watching that video, um, there's a wee watermark on the bottom of the, the video. Click on that um, and subscribe if you haven't already for all you YouTubers that have already got an account. And have a fantastic Christmas wherever you are. And hope you have a great time. And uh, keep them safe. And uh, aye, just go for it. Go mad. Go mental. It's silly season. Have a great time. Let loose. Go for it. Do it. <laughs>